What's up, YouTube? Before I get into the video, I just want to say thank you to Charlotte Hornets for having me. Um, and I want to talk a little bit about the pre-draft workout. Uh, the workout itself was really fun. I enjoyed it a lot. Uh, I feel like I played really well in it. And um, it was really eye-opening. Um, you got to experience a little different things than what you're used to. Uh, you're pushed by the pro-level coaches and everything else. Um, but it's a lot like other workouts when you work out with a lot of guys around the same height and same skill set as you. Um, you do shooting, you do one-on-ones, you do drills, um, and then you play uh, games, you know? Um, but the biggest thing to start off with is you had to get a physical first, of course, uh, EKG, all that. Um, and from there on, you go through the workout and you play your best. I think the biggest thing I took away from this was energy and effort at all times and talking. Um, I know talking to new guys is always difficult. Um, you're not going to just click like you think you would. Uh, you're all hoopers, so things that you do is just mature and just say, hey, my name's Cedric or my name's so-and-so and what's yours? Uh, getting to know that and being in the workout cheering each other on is really big. Um, because when you do play those games, you play, you do those drills, talking to that other person, coaches look at that and they, they like it a lot. Um, and then defense, I mean, hey, they know everybody can score. I mean, people are pros for a reason. Everybody can put the ball in the basket at some point. Uh, the biggest thing is guarding your yard. Uh, I think guarding and talking to somebody is what they look at the most. Um, but that's it for me. Let's get into the video. Like and subscribe. I'll catch y'all guys later. Okay. Um, it's 6 o'clock in the morning. Been up since about 5.30 at the airport. Now in Tucson. Um, heading to Charlotte for my first NBA workout ever. And I'm super excited to see how this goes. Um, first of the way. Um, let you know when I get to Dallas. All right, heading to KB10. Um, I board to Charlotte at 6.40. Or, sorry, to Dallas first. And then from there to Charlotte. Um, super excited, kind of nervous. Uh, it's an essential kind of weekend, you know. Got my little bag, my, good, my bigger look bag my, uh, with my bear on it. I can't wait to see how this goes. First ever NBA workout. Super, super excited to do it. And really, really nervous at the same time. But I'll keep you updated. Um, and we'll record as we go. See y'all in Dallas. All right, just landed in Dallas. Uh, I slept that whole plane ride, holy shit. Uh -oh. I think the guy next to me definitely has drill on him because I woke up and that my whole front of my hoodie was wet. Um, slept great though, so. But uh, we're in Dallas now, so walking halfway across America just to get to another plane. Got about an hour and a half layover. And then we are on the last flight to Charlotte. This is an adventure and a half. Uh, I'm enjoying it. Gonna get some food in a second. Haven't decided what I'm gonna eat yet, but we'll see because everybody and their mom is apparently at 7 Eleven. Like, what? But we'll see what we get. Alright, so we made it to the next gate. Um, that, like, hour, hour and a half till my next flight. So we're gonna lay here, maybe take a nap, you know. We'll see how it goes. And then go on this long flight to Charlotte. Um, get there, go to the hotel, let y'all see the hotel, and we'll go from there. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. It's four players in this flight. So I don't know I don't know. Called the guy from Charlotte 
see what they said, and I said I had five in the right Point three, we don't throw it in my workout. Let's see how this goes. Okay, so we got a flight. Um, stress is now not as bad as it was. But I have to be my best behavior because I already messed up once. That means I will be early to everything. So the videos might be a little bit shorter from here on out. But hey, we got it. So you. And nothing can go wrong. Oh no, it all went wrong. Alright, so after this hectic mess, I made to Charlotte. Uh, I'm watching the plus. Now I'm heading to um, the show for you that I have and I'm going to the hotel. Um, I missed the physical um, today. And I'll be getting up early tomorrow because I have to change a little bit with our camera is usually right. Um, all the flights were a little crazy, but hey, we made it. They didn't catch my workout, God bless. And I guess you what I do. So, I will show you the hotel when I get there. And then we'll go from there. I'm excited. things uh got to i shot it pretty well got to meet the head coach the gym all those guys um at the end of it it's just like 2k you do an interview at the end of it it's actually really cool they ask you a whole bunch of questions though actually about your past what you like to do in your free time uh so that was really fun uh as far as the drills go basic stuff shooting drills three on three all that a lot of guys same height as me um, so I had a good time, but 
pack it up now. Got to get out of here in the next couple minutes to head back to the airport. Flights in a couple hours. Um, but that's it. So. Quick little trip, huh? But it was fun. I had a great time. Thank you, Charlie Hornets, for having me. And hopefully, I get to see you again. But until then, I'm out. I haven't had Bojangles for so long and I'm so happy. Oh, I forgot that it's just on it. So, Bojangles time. What the hell? Yay, it's been stuck in the airport all day again. Yay, yay, it's so fun. Yay. Look what I found in the airport, you guys. Yeah, 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 yeah,